Welcome to your weekly roundup of positivity in the world. We're going to go through the news this week that will put a smile on your face. So let's get to it. By now, we've all heard of Meta and the so-called Metaverse, formerly known as Facebook. Well, how about if we told you there was a better verse out there, one that is solely focused on charity. The soon to be launched Betterverse is a virtual world to save our own, where we can donate to charities with the power of blockchain and get a picture of the good we're doing. The founders say it will bring charitable giving into the future of Web3. The service will ultimately allow people to donate to any cause and in return receive a unique NFT that captures and visualizes the real world impact. Sounds pretty cool. Billie Eilish has announced the climate-focused event Overheated, which is taking place at the O2 in collaboration with two nonprofits, Support and Feed and Reverb. For six days this year in June, Overheated will bring together activists, musicians and designers to discuss the climate crisis and what they're doing to make a difference. Every day during the event in June, there will be panel discussions, live performances and documentaries to view, all discussing the climate crisis and how we really can take action to make a difference. Maggie Baird, founder of Support and Feed, said, We are thrilled to be in London to have this opportunity to connect and discuss different ways we can take action to mitigate the climate crisis. A threatened woodpecker has been seen for the first time in decades, causing conservationists to celebrate. Since 1994, a very grainy black and white photo was thought to be all that remained of the ivory-billed woodpecker. That was until researchers spotted it in the forests of Louisiana this month. Before the sighting in Louisiana, the woodpecker was actually registered as extinct by the US Fish and Wildlife Service, but thankfully, they're back. Science has proved that helping others really can make you age happier. The study, which was published in a science journal, found that those who donate to charity and do nice things for others had an increase in their production of oxytocin. Now, oxytocin is a mood-enhancing hormone that is thought to decrease in the production as we grow older, but this study proves the opposite. So if that doesn't encourage you to get out, help others in your community and volunteer, then we don't know what will. An incredible woman in the US has just completed 104 marathons in 104 consecutive days. And not only that, the woman named Jackie did this all on one leg and with a prosthesis. So Jackie's goal was to break a Guinness World Record for the most consecutive marathons run by a woman. And she also wanted to raise money for charity while doing it. Jackie originally aimed to raise $30,000 for amputee blade runners. Now that's a charity that provides blades for amputees as many insurance companies don't cover it. But Jackie ended up raising $192,000 and completed all 104 marathons. What a woman. And that's it. We're back every Friday, rounding up the positive news of the week that will make you smile. So make sure you hit that subscribe button so you can get a weekly dose of positivity. Or you can head to our website, smileymovement.org, to get a daily dose of positive news.